Put your legs together! What's going on everyone? This is Marshmallow Man and welcome back to Rusty Lake Ruth. Let's be honest guys, how long do you think I was going to be able to stay away from this one? I made it one day. <laughs> Let's get back in. More Rusty Lake Roots. Uh, where we left off, we just finished Mary's storyline. We have this little side story over here. Let's do this side. Summer 1870, The Staircase with James. Okay. Oh, I gotta click down here. Okay. Uh, I see this. This doesn't look... This doesn't look like it's in the right order. Um, can I move this over here? There we go. Okay. And then move this like this. Oh, I see what I gotta do. Okay. I need something to connect this up. That's too high. Uh, oh my god. This is... This is tricky. And that one doesn't even have to be first. Okay. But I guess there's multiple ways to do it, right? Um, can I move this all the way over here? That doesn't line up. Okay, so I think this has to be on this end. Wait, hold on. Does this line up with this? It does. Okay. Nice. Nice. I'll figure this out. <laughs> uh, it might take me a minute, but I'll figure it out, damn it. Okay. And then this has to come back down like this. And then to go from the bottom up, you have to use this one. Nice. Damn it. There you go. Okay. Okay. And then these just have to go over here. Slide this one over and I figured it out. I don't... I don't know what I figured out, but I figured it out, damn it. Oh, and I gotta put these birds in order and... These are all the people from Rusty Lake Hotel! Uh, I don't remember the order of them, though. I, is there gonna be some order to help me? I'm sure that they'll give me the answer somewhere in here. Okay, let's look around. What is this? I've got a note. Uh, triangle, moon, this thing, and then up arrow. Okay. Is that helpful? Oh. I can open the window. No, wait. Did something move down here? Or is that all in my head? That's all in my head. Okay. Let's... Well, I left the window open. I can't shut it, so hopefully that was the right thing to do. All right. I can't look any further that way. Uh, let's go talk to James. Hi, James. How are you doing? He wants an arch? What are you reading? Oh, another code. Spring of 1859. My brother and I are in the final stage of finding the elixir, the alchemist. And then there's that weird little symbol. I don't know what that means. Okay. Well, you have an interesting book there, buddy. I wish I could find you an arch. I don't know where to look. Uh, here's a picture. Is this... Oh, this is, uh, the married couple. This is his... Is that his dad and mom? Or his brother and his... I don't know. Let's rip the picture down. Oh, another code. All these codes. Why? Why? Okay, I can figure this one out without having to see anything. Okay, slide. I like the book sliding. The book sliding is the nice. Okay. This needs to go right here. Uh, hmm, hmm. And this needs to go like right there. And then this needs to go like right there. Okay, okay. Ah, and then this needs to go, wait, no, no, no. Okay. Huh. So I have an orange that connects to brown. And then I have... These are all in the right order. Can I move this to the end? Move this all the way to the end, and that, does that do it? No, that doesn't do it. Ah, these have to go in the middle right here. That goes there, and this goes here, and I did it. Nice! Nice, I'm solving shit, doing shit. I wish I knew the order these were supposed to go in. Uh, I'm, I'm making progress. What is this? Oh. Oh, okay. Oh, hello. Hello. Oh, I can just scroll through these. Okay, so if the arrow is at the bottom or on the right? Is that on the right? I don't I don't know. Hold on. Uh moon. Okay, do they all have a different code, a different piece of the puzzle? I think they do. Okay. So if the arrow's on the right, you have moon on the one closest. So this has to be the moon. Okay. Let's go back. Yeah, good. That stays. 
and then this one has to be the triangle, and this one has to be the triangle. Let me tip my head to help me out. Okay, so this one and this one are triangles, is that right? Yeah. So then the rest of them, I'll make them all... For now, I'll make them all a dot. So I know I need to get to them still. Okay. Okay. And then there's more of it over here. So on the right... Uh, triangle up to the right, and then triangle on the bottom left. Right? Triangle top right, triangle bottom left, and moon next to it. So triangle top right, triangle bottom left, and moon next to it. Okay. And then his book has to have the final clue. Let me see your book. Okay, dot top middle, dot top right, moon in the middle. Okay. Uh, this just needs to be a moon. That's it. Nice! I got a fucking telescope! Or binoculars. Okay. Well, let's look out the window. Can I use this out the window? I wanna look. I can! I can look at things! What am I looking for? There's weird things happening in there. Oh! I see. I see. Okay. Uh, bunny, pigeon, boar, crow. Bunny, pigeon, boar, crow, deer, vulture. Okay. Bunny, pigeon, boar, crow, boar, crow, deer, vulture. I did it! Nice! He doesn't even flinch out of his chair. He's just okay with what's happening. Sweet, I figured it out. Oh, he found the archway, though. Here's the archway. Let's go down. Down the spiral staircase into madness. Oh, I solved this one. Another puzzle done. Sweet. Okay. Give me a check mark. And uh, on to the next one. As the tree grows larger, we'll do another uh, spring, 1867. Mary's having childbirth. Oh, yeah, you look good and pregnant. What do you want? A spoon of what? Is that is that cocaine? Okay, I'll look around. I'll see what I find. Uh, oh, I found this. A faucet. That might be good. Okay. Is this locked? Alright. Well, let's go this way. Oh, hello, dog. How are you? Can I get this key? Oh, I need to give you something then, I guess? Uh, okay. Well, let me check all the drawers. Scissors. Fantastic. Uh, I guess that's it. What is this? Uh, April 26th, 1867. Samuel Vanderboom. There's a clock, two o'clock. Uh, April 26th, 1867. They all have the same date on it. Albert Vanderboom. Did, were there triplets? Emma Vanderboom. Were there three children? There's uh, all their birth certificates. Jesus Christ. Okay, well, I got the spoon. And I got a mortar. Okay. Well. Oh, I can open the window in the rain. That probably wasn't good. Uh, maybe it was. I don't know. Can I cut the key off the dog? Nope, he doesn't like that. He does not like that. Sorry, doggy. All right. I got a plant. Nice. Can I grind the plant up? And mortar. Grind. Nice. I got this dust. Here. Spoon with birth potion. I don't think that's how it works. But that's what she wanted, so I'll give it to her. Here you go. Oh! She's... Put your legs together! I gotta cut the baby! No! It's gonna fall on its head! Are you having another one? Have the next one. Cut it. Yeah. God, she is like in no pain at all. They're just fucking sliding out of there like they're coming out of a water slide. Uh, what is that? The placenta. Now you want a bottle. Do I gotta feed this to the dog? I mean, I shouldn't be surprised when weird shit's happening in these games, but that was really weird. I did not like that at all. Okay, I got three bottles. Ugh. God, I feel sick. Alright, can I fill them up with water? 
Nice. Why do I have a spout? Wait, can I not fill up another one with water? No? What am I supposed to- how am I supposed to... Spread the love? Oh, are they not in the right order? Why are they all wearing sumo gear? Okay, do you want- here. You shut up. Okay, you have some. Now you shut up. What am I supposed to do? I have that tap. I'm sure I have that tap for a reason. And I'm sure... Okay, wait. Is she gonna give me a hint? What do you want now? What do you want? Oh, she just... Oh, she already gave me that hint. Okay, baby want bottle. I know. That's not helpful. The dog's asleep. Oh! 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 Put that in there. There we go. Bottle with wine? I don't like that. Okay. Well, back me out of here. Up here, does it tell me which one wants the wine? Okay. The wine is probably Albert. It was the one with the little hair. The water is the bald one. I th wait, hold on. Or is water the blue? I think blue is the water. So, water is the one with the crazy hair. And wine is the one with the down hair. Okay. Alright. So, yeah, you need the water. You need the wine. Feeding wine to a child. The other one is white, which is milk. Are you gonna feed, fill this up for me? Yes, you are. Well, fantastic. Thank you so much for that. I really appreciate that. Here, you have this. And I did it! Another one! Nice, we found the babies. Alright, let's grow the tree. Let's find another branch. Let's, uh, let's do another puzzle. Another rusty, like, puzzle. Summer of 1870, the elixir. Okay, James, what are you doing in here? Why are you hiding behind that pillar like a fucking creep? <laughs> okay. Oh, not a weighing one. Oh, I suck at these. I am the worst. I am the worst. Nope, that does not go there. Nope. Okay. Put that over here. Uh, put that over here. And then put this over here. Oh, I'm close. Okay, put this one over here. Nope. Nope, put that back on here. I'll figure it out, damn it. Put this here. And this here. Oh, I'm so close. Put this one over here. And then this one back over here. Wait, this one over here. And then this one over here. <laughs> I'll figure it out. <laughs> will I, though? Will I? I don't think I will. I don't know what the fuck I'm supposed to do. I give up. Let's... Oh! God damn it. How many pounds? One pound for the plus. Two. And I gotta figure out how many pounds the other ones are? Okay. Well, that's kind of helpful, but I'm not sure if it really is. Oh, the dog's down here in the basement now with me. This elixir will bring you eternal life or sudden death. The alchemist. Okay. That's helpful. Thank you. Thank you, dog. What do you want? Do you want something? Oh, I don't have anything for you. Leave me alone. Okay, I gotta figure this out. Okay. Three pounds goes in. Four pounds goes in, plus four pounds, plus five pounds. Uh, three, seven, eleven, sixteen. So all of them together, or does this thing equal sixteen when it gets a drop from four different bottles? I don't understand what the fuck is going on. This is the first one where I'm actually really stuck on something. Mainly because I don't understand what the diagram is telling me. Uh... One pound and two pounds. I understand that. And I understand these have question marks because we don't know how much these weigh. But then I don't understand what this is telling me down here. Three pounds with a drop into there. Four pounds with a drop into there. Four pounds with a drop into there. Five pounds with a drop into there. I don't understand what that means. This one's tricky. This one's really tricky. I don't understand what this means at all. Will he give me a clue if I talk to him? Or is he just going to tell me? Yeah. I figured that's all you're going to tell me. Okay. Well... 
do I still have to, like, balance it? Is that still my goal here? Because I tried a million different things and it wouldn't balance. It's so close, but it won't balance. It's, that's so close. Am I, am I crazy for not understanding this part? Let me just look at this picture. I don't understand what it's telling me. Oh, okay, I think I understand. I understand. Okay. Okay, 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 I get it. I get it, I get it, I get it, I'm stupid. Okay, so this is one and this one's two. So I gotta find which one of these is three pounds. This one's three pounds. So you're three. Okay. Then I gotta find which one is four pounds. So to find which one's four pounds... Ah, damn it, okay. So the tilde is three, and the X is four. Okay, so then I gotta do three, four, four, five. So the tilde is three, X is four, O is five. So three, four, four, five. Nice! Just the satisfaction you get in this game when you figure something out. It's awesome. Nice, I have the elixir. Do you want the elixir, sir? Here you go. Here's an elixir for you. Oh, you want me to give it to the dog? <gasps> Is the dog gonna die? It's green elixir. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, he's fine. He's fine. Now what do you want? Oh, you want some now. Now that you saw the dog's okay. Did he die or did he just throw up? He died. Oh my god. Okay. We solved another one. Let's grow the tree. We're going to end this episode of Rusty Lake Roots right here. Uh, I hope you guys will join me back for the next episode. It would probably be in maybe a day again because I, I, as much as I keep telling myself... Hold off, Matt. Wait a little bit before you play again, because once you're done with this, you're going to be sad that it's over. I, I really enjoy this game, and I just want to keep playing it every day. I wish it was a never-ending game. I, maybe someday something like that will be possible. <laughs> but for now, I'm going to be very happy while I'm playing this game. Thank you guys so much for joining me back here for another episode of Rusty Lake Roots. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, do me a huge favor and hit the like button down below, and I will see you guys in the next episode of Rusty Lake Roots. Bye!